Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is now time for the best real estate podcast online. It is time for Lakeway Area Real Estate Talk Live with Mike and Dave Elkins presented by Elite Realty Group. So let's talk some real estate today. Every time we go live, we want to bring you real estate information. And today's some good one, all right? We got some good information, as we do every time. We think it all is good, right? Yeah. We think all the information yeah, is good, but right. we do have some good information today. And I'm going to give a disclaimer up front before I ever start talking to you, okay. okay? Because we're going to talk about, here's what it is today, four reasons why, okay, you should never buy or sell without a realtor. Mm -hmm. That's what we're talking about today. Now, we are realtors. We okay? are. Yes, we Absolutely. are. Absolutely. Yes. And that's what we do for a living. So, I don't want you to think we're sitting here telling you this because we're realtors, we are partly telling you that. Right? Yes, that's true. But we don't care if it's us. We don't care if it's another company here in the Lake no, area. We don't right. care if you're watching us over in Bangladesh, China, as we have. Is that where I said? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Use a realtor. When you need real estate, use a realtor. Right. We're going to give you four reasons why today you never want to buy or sell without a realtor and the professionalism and things that they have. This is what I'm going to say. All right? I'm, going to, I'm going to say this, and I hope that it spreads around the world. Okay. There are a lot of great people in the real estate business, not just here in Morristown, but worldwide. That's true. Find you a good one. We hope you call us. Right. That's why we're talking to you, right. right? We hope that you call us. But if you don't want to call us, call somebody. And here's why I'm saying that. This is for your benefit and your protection and your goodness of, of your mind. family, peace of mind, all those things. Get those people to help you, okay? So right. we're going to give you four reasons why today you should never buy or sell without a real estate agent. Should you need one, call us. 423-307-8566. Hey. We'll be glad to help you. But if you don't call us, call somebody else, right? Call somebody right. else. That, again, will help you. There's a lot here in the Lakeway area that will do you an outstanding job. Yes. But we would, we want to give you this info today. So here we go. Four reasons why never buy or sell without a realtor. If we need to cut into a taco conversation any time okay. here. Well, Gary said something about he don't want no tacos. He wants steak. And then Co said steak tacos. Steak tacos. Who can't go with steak tacos? Right. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter what's on the hard or soft shell taco. No. I'm just taking either yes. one of them. Give me a dozen Question of Question real fast. Okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah, no, we just said that. Yes. Have you ever eaten a chicken soft taco? Or a chicken hard taco? Uh, yeah, I've eaten chicken tacos. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I don't think I ever have. I don't like them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I mean, I'm not a chicken eater. That's well, why. I can eat a fajita, chicken well, fajita. Now, now see, here's, here it is about the chicken. You got to burn that chicken plum up for me to get out of <laughs> Now, if I can have some burnt chicken. Right. I can eat it all day Take long. It. But sometimes I get it and I just look and I think, this could be bad. It could be bad chicken. I'm scared of it. You know what I'm saying? I get scared of it. I had enough okay, yeah. bad chicken. I, had to, right? I, I, didn't, I had to, yeah. well, they got them at Taco Bell, but I've I never know, ordered. I ain't going down that road. Yeah. yeah. I ain't going down that road. Four reasons why to never eat chicken. I mean, to, to uh, never <laughs> buy or sell without a realtor. All right. That's what we're going to talk about okay. today. You want me to go first? As always, right? Sure. I got to go first. Sure. Here's the number one, and these are in no particular order, all right? But you want to work with a realtor. Again, whether buying or selling, it does not matter. Use the realtor. The number one reason is it's for the expertise, the professionalism, the knowledge that the realtor is going to bring to the table. Okay? Right, right. This is what I tell people a lot of times. I get, we get asked this question a lot, and we answer this question a lot. Do I have to? Do I have to use a realtor? Do I have to use an agent? The answer to that is no. No. 100% no. You do not have to. You can buy and sell without an agent. We've said that many times on this show, by the way. Right. However, we like to tell people this, you know, you're, you're using the services of a realtor to get the things I just told you about. Their expertise, their professionalism, a lot of things we're going to talk about here on the show today. That's one of the reasons why you want to use the realtor. Right. And so you have those things. If you are going to go in and have an opinion about your, you've got a sore throat, all right, although I love to diagnose myself. You go to it. When I really need some help, I go to the professional. You know what I'm right. saying? I'm going to go to somebody that can do, even though I can do a lot, I can diagnose, I can go to the pharmacy, I can buy the over-the-counter stuff, and it may or may not help me. Right. 
But when I really need the services, I go to a professional. All right. right. Same thing with real estate. Sometimes you try yourself. I absolutely do. And, and then, then you realize it's too much for me. It's a lot. I can't to it. do it right. That's exactly. I'm right. gonna go to a professional. I mean, that's that is the truth. And that is the, that analogy. That same thing is what we tell people a lot of times. Can you? Absolutely, you can. Sure can. You can do. You can do anything. You can do anything you want to do. You too. Right? Tell you how to do anything. You too. <laughs> will tell you how to do anything. You can do anything. But again, what is, what's the reason you never want to do that is because of the expertise that they have. There are so many hurdles to jump over. There's so many things to navigate around. If you're selling, you've got to get it priced right. You need market knowledge. You need inside knowledge of what's happened around me, what's sold, what's moving, who's coming in. You need somebody that knows what's happening in the economy. Are jobs coming? Are jobs leaving? Right. What's going on with that and specific to your neighborhood? A realtor can get you that information. Again, buying or selling. We'll say the same thing on the buying side yeah. because you'd want to know, is this a... Uh, yeah. Good investment. Yeah, right. Is this right. a good? Am investment? I getting a good deal on this house? Yeah. Am give I me some historical data here. You yeah. know, give me demographic data. Give me those kind of things of what's happening. Again, going to the professional, they can get just a little bit more potentially. Mm -hmm. We got the internet now. You can do anything on the internet, mm -hmm. right? We like ain't just landed on the moon today. <laughs> right, yeah. We understand that, but again. You don't want to do these things by yourself because use that expertise of the agent. Use right. that expertise that a realtor will be able to give for you. Again, those are the kind of things that are just going to be beneficial to you and your family and your real estate needs. Again, whether buying, I saw this thing today and it was about the biggest search engine site that is used in real estate today. Okay, We've talked about it before on this show many, many times. but. The stat that I said said Zillow, which is where a lot of people go to search for homes. Absolutely. And get the value of their home. Right. We've done the show before that said their Zestimate, everybody's yes. seen those before, was most of the time 40 to 60% could go either way off. That right. was an average. Sometimes they were right, but 40 to right. 60% of the time they were wrong. But I saw a stat today from this guy, from a realtor, that said... Zillow only shows 60 to 70% of the homes that's even listed on the market just because they have an agenda. Right. There's things they're trying to sell and do and push and all those things. And so sometimes you're not even getting all of the data from them. Here's where going back to a local realtor, I'm telling you all this to say this, you've got access to 100% of what's out there. You're right. not going to have to right. worry about is there an agenda that homes aren't being showed or pushed to the side or put right. in the back burner because you know you're getting that from a from an agent. Right. So reason number one is use the realtor's expertise. Right. Use their knowledge. Use those things. That's reason number one why you want to never buy or sell without using the services of a realtor. You got anything to add to that? No. Go with number two. All right, number two, I'm, I'm going to piggyback right here on what you're talking about. Go with it. Is you, got, you pretty much have a turbocharged search engine. I love it. So I love the just, word turbocharged. Just like right. you just said, Zillow might not show everything that is listed, even though that's the where the majority of the people go to. Oh, yeah. It's most, not even close. Most of your agents, and mm -hmm. we'll say most, there's still some who don't. That's right. Uh, but True most story. agents, we do. Mm -hmm. Right here, you can go. It's not on there. It's nowhere. Mm -hmm. But we've got a company website. All, all of our agents pretty much have their own websites. Mm -hmm. So that is not only where you can go find our listings, Absolutely. It's also every listing that's on our local MLS right. is there. Right. You can go there. Now, again, we've talked about this in the past, too. People say, oh, I can go to Zillow and look, like you just said. Yeah. They're not all on there. Right. And then, two, Zillow pulls from us. They get it from us. We had to sign a thing saying you have permission to use our data. Absolutely. Because we know people's that's going to Zillow. Going to look. So, we, of course, we want our stuff to go there, too. Absolutely. But they come there first. It's right. on our stuff first, and right. then Zillow gets it from there. Absolutely. But so again, yeah. And even at that, I was going to say this is not even on the thing to talk about. But I was going to say this is because a lot of times it's not that um, it's not that there's anything secretive or anything like that about it. But it's like I might know mm -hmm. that I've got, just like I just listed this condo the other sure. day. I knew I was going to list the condo. We just hadn't pinpointed down a date yet. When it was going to happen. Right. Right. So I knew it was going to, I right. knew it was going to be. Knew there. it was coming. Right. I knew it was coming. So even at that, 
realtors, we talk amongst each other. Sure. We know that, okay, Gary might have a listing yeah. that he's going to put on the market next week. Right. We might be able to talk about that. And he, he sure. we have meetings. We tell each That's other what about stuff. Say, yeah. yeah, we do meetings and stuff like that. But even agents outside of our office, mm -hmm. same scenario. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I showed a house a couple of weeks ago to a lady and... Uh, I caught about a listing that she had, uh -huh. and she had talking about you caught a realtor. Caught a realtor about a listing that she had. Uh -huh. Want to show some people of mine, and then that one was actually under contract. But she had another one that she was going to list four days later. Gotcha. Just gotcha. Had, you know, getting the paperwork, right. all that stuff finalized, and then boom, we know about it right off right. the bat before, before anybody else anything else even knows about it. Yeah. Right. And again, one more step, and then I'm going to quit talking sure. let you go. But like even it. at that is that if we're in a neighborhood, okay, a lot mm -hmm. of times we sell houses in subdivisions, you know, real popular thing. Mm -hmm. uh, a good realtor will also even go out and work for you in, if you need that neighborhood, I've yeah, done this need before, that area. need that area, yeah. whatever. Hey, I'm not above going up knocking on the door and saying, hey, we was looking for here or right. whatever i got some people i sold a house in this neighborhood i got more people wanting to come into this neighborhood mm -hmm. if you thought about selling now right. i'm helping you sell and i'm helping and i'm trying to find a home for my buyer right so either way a, a, yeah. a good realtor is going to go to work for you and that's what i'm saying you're talking about you know turbocharged search there are more there's a whole lot even though the internet is the by far it's not even close don't let anybody ever it's not even close that's where people go and look for houses right. that is it yeah uh, there are still other ways. Now, we go back to, let's go back to what you said about Zillow because I think it's a good point and I want to make it real quick. They get all their data from us. That's not right. just here, that's that's nationwide. They get their data from us. Right. We got the data first. Yeah. In the markets that we're in now, if you have been looking for a house, you understand the inventory is down very, very low. Nationwide. Okay, nationwide. nationwide. And this is across the board. Buyers are still in the market looking, so homes are at a premium. Mm-hmm. So it's it really is. You want to know first. If you could know before, you are ahead of the game. Right. Working with a good realtor can potentially put you ahead of the game. That's a great reason right. to be able to do that. Because again, we get the data first, and then it goes out to Zillow. So working with someone local, you're going. They're going to get the data. We're going to get the data. We're right. going to let you know before the world knows. Because right. we get it out on that. Right. Very very good point. If you've just joined us, this is the 99th time we went live. Right, Lakeway Area Real Estate. That's what you're watching today. We're talking about four reasons why you want to never buy or sell without using the services of a realtor. We want you to know this today. We've went through two. Also, we've been talking tacos today, okay? Yeah. Our would you rather question is, would you rather have a hard shell or a soft shell taco? Got some great answers coming in. Mm -hmm. We've learned there is now a cheese. Cheese shell cheese taco. Cheese shell taco, which we'll be trying out shortly. Yes. And giving the review on That's that. on the ketosis diet. That's exactly right. So we went through two of the reasons. Here's number three, all right? And it goes a little bit deeper with what you're going to, with what you were talking about, okay? It goes a little deeper. Number three is you want to work with a good realtor because they're connected. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to say they're connected to the industry, okay? Meaning, you're going to, if you're buying, okay, you're going to need lender services. Mm -hmm. All right, we cannot tell you how many times we said this. We cannot tell you who to go to. Right. However, we can put you in touch with the And many, in a nutshell, we multiple. don't care who you go No, we, that's, that's exactly right. Yeah. But we can put you in touch with multiple people. Again, whether that be lenders, home inspectors, appraisers, uh, home inspections, home warranties, you name it. All right. right. We just had the other day, what was the house had to have over radon? Radon, right? yeah. Radon. We had to get some information about that. That's not a common thing. All yeah. right? We were able to do that. But we are, again, realtors, they're connected. Remember going back to the doctor analogy. That's what the doctor does for a living. They're a professional at it. This right. is what a realtor does for a living. They should be a professional at it. They yeah. should be a grade above. All right. right. They should be able to do more service, more help you more than just a regular old Joe off of the street. They should be able to do those things for you. So you want to work with them again because that that stuff is good. The connections that they already have. It's not like you say, well, I need a home inspector. Right. We got to go start shaking the woods and finding a well, home Well, it's just inspector. like you just said about the doctor. If you go to the doctor because your foot's hurting. Right. That doctor might just be a family doctor, but yeah. he knows 
What's them you foot on? doctors called? Petey yeah. something? Pet up? Podiatrist. I have no idea. I think that's right. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah. yeah. Or is that one of them step accounts? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Maybe. So, yeah. But anyways, they know other professionals Absolutely. is what I was getting at. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It all cause the They're connection. all tied together. It's the connection. Yeah. So, again, you want to work with a realtor because of that. Again, that's just services that you're going to be able to get provided to make that process easier. Now, look here. Here's what, here's what you need to see. If you're talking about a deal, a, a home that's sold, and there is a mortgage took out. I'm not going to answer this. I'm going to ask you this question. There's okay. a mortgage took out. What is the average time frame from contract to close? 30 to 45 days. Okay. That's if it goes perfect. Perfect, yeah. Now, you start having to try to do all this stuff by yourself. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a whole lot longer. Absolutely. That's where that connections are taking place. Good benefit for you to be able to use a realtor. That's number three. In, oh, I was going to say insurance people's in that, too. Oh, yeah, you absolutely. Know, you got to get insurances and stuff mm -hmm. like that. For other. So, what am I on number four? Okay, so. The last one. Okay, is that... Um, which is a question that I might ask you here in a minute. You might not know the answer to it. But, but a lot of people don't know there's a difference between a realtor uh -huh. and a real estate agent. Absolutely. So realtors, we we're realtors. Right. Uh, we have to, we're part of the National Association of Realtors. We have a strict code of ethics Absolutely. that we have to go by. Yes, we We are. got the proper forms, legality forms that mm -hmm. we have to fill out. We will conduct business in a certain way. We'll treat people yeah, in a certain we way. Treat, we won't discriminate. Right, so on and right. So, so we have that that we have to go by. Absolutely. If you're not dealing with a realtor, you're mm -hmm. dealing with a real estate agent. Uh -huh. Is there real estate agents around here? Uh, I mean, there can be. It's but I mean, I, I don't really, I don't know that I know of any. I don't know. I, uh, can't I think pretty it. much everybody around here is part of the NAR, the National Association of Realtors. So. I might be wrong on that. Yeah, but I don't know. I think, but again, we all have to, we have to take uh, continuing education classes right. on all this stuff right. to where we have to, again, we got so many guidelines that we got to go by and mm -hmm. things that we can do and can't do. Mm -hmm. But again, that's, it's all it's protection, protection and benefits yes. to the clients to that the client. we serve. Absolutely. Whether buying or selling, right. that code of ethics is something again that we go by and we talk about a whole lot within our office here oh, yeah. Yeah. because again, doing things right will always be the right thing to do. Right. So we want to uphold that. But again, we've said working that with hundred times. We've bowed out of yeah. deals before because absolutely things wasn't going to go the right way. wasn't going to be the ethical thing for right. us to do. But again, a realtor they they're going to do that. So not only are they going to represent you in purchasing your home, again going back to these connections, putting you in touch with the right kind of people, and not steering you to one person or making you go to one person or doing this. They're going to give you those options. But all of this kind of works together. Because of what you just said, that title of realtor, that being that right. professional that we say we're going to stand up and be, we're going to do that. If you ever need the services, you ever have a question, you ever have thoughts, you ever want any kind of guidance or opinions, if you've watched us any at all, you know for 99 times we've sat here in front of this camera and we'll give you our opinion, but you ever need any kind of assistance in real estate at all, we are more than, that's what we do. Yeah, we answer questions all the time. Was, We're totally 100% nothing. I was going to say, wasn't, right? it, wasn't it just last week that guy called in at the office and he, he, I mean, he had a question about the sinkhole? Yes. Remember that? Yes. I mean, so if you got questions, whatever right. it is, yeah. real estate related. We would love to help you. Or with what that. our favorite tacos are. That's you exactly can call right. in there. You can call. We, we will answer your questions. Help you send us a message to our page. And we know you guys do that. We, we already have answered a lot of your questions. A lot of the references and things we talk about on this show are because of you, our viewers, you, our clients. You guys have asked us these. And we're like, hey, if they're thinking it, somebody else is thinking it too. So let's address that. You all have made this show wildly successful. Absolutely. And we appreciate you guys doing that. So that We thank each and every one of you for listening to today's podcast. Tune in for future episodes by subscribing to our channel and get the latest and greatest real estate information right here on Lakeway Area Real Estate Talk Live presented by Elite Realty Group. Until next time, have a great and blessed day.